In this video, I'll show you how to delete your Fiverr account. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and hit the subscribe button. And once you have subscribed, please go and leave a like as well. I really do appreciate it. So in this guide, I'm showing you all the steps to fully deactivate your Fiverr account. Make sure you do watch this video right until the end as I'm showing you important steps. Without any further ado, let's go and get into this. I'm on Fiverr and let's go and continue with this tutorial. So before we delete your account, we do need to go and log in. So let's go and click sign in up here. And then as you can see, you just got to enter your email or username and your password. And then it's going to go and take you to the Fiverr homepage or your profile page. And before we go and delete our account, just remember you're going to lose everything. Every sort of Fiverr delivery you've had if you're a buyer. And if you've sold anything, you're going to lose all of your messages as well um, on if you're a Fiverr seller. So just remember everything on your Fiverr account will be gone. So make sure you save anything you put on. And of course, make sure you use any funds which are in your Fiverr account. As you can see, I've got some here. Or would that be withdraw them? So now we're going to be ready to go and delete our Fiverr account. So all you want to do is go to the top right where we've got your profile picture, click on there, and then you've got a list of different options. So you've got profile, dashboard, and then you've got some other bits and you've got settings. So what you want to do is go to settings and it's going to take you here. As you can see, it's going to take a minute down here. And then as you can see here, we've got account deactivation. This is what happens when you deactivate your account. Your profile gigs won't be shown on Fiverr anymore. Active orders will be canceled and you won't be able to reactivate your gigs. Now this is deleting your account. So then all you have to do is go and select the reason for why you're leaving. And you can even just put something else if you don't have anything. And then all you want to do is go and click deactivate account and it's going to go and deactivate your account and delete it. That's literally today's video guys. If you found it useful, please go down below and hit the subscribe button. Leave a like for more. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.